Yoski guys, it's Cabal. And um, hold on, got recording on my phone right now. My PC's not on now. Um, with yeah, another video. Now, in today's video, this is um, I haven't done one of these in a while. It's um, a story time. I have not done one of these in a while. This just, and this just happened recently. Anyways, like I was saying, it's story time. So, me and my boys, Terry and Cor, we was playing Fortnite, right? It was late at night. We was playing Reload, and there, um, we landed, we was dropping Retail Road, right? This Travis Scott decided to land on me. So, I, I found, I think it was a green or a blue, green or blue pump. And the Travis Scott decided to land on me. I grabbed the gun, and I knocked him, right? I did laugh it up on him, thirsted him. You know, that's usual, usual tough food that I do, you know what I'm saying? I just, you know, it, it, laugh. it's on site. Every time I get a kill, it's laugh it up. I, I got L-Dance on my other account. So, so uh, if account merging comes back, it's going to be L-Dance on site. Feel me? But anyways, so he respawned. He spun back on me, right? Now, I'm not sure. I either beat him. Actually, um, I was fighting his teammates, right? It was his little boyfriends, his little cum buddies, right? And I was, I was 1 HP or something like that. Actually, I wasn't 1 HP. I was low, though. Man, he had an AR. I only had my pump still. He had every right to kill me. I was low. He got me to like one HP. I, I killed him again. I knocked him again. One pumped him again. And I did laugh it up on him again. All right? So then, then after I did it again, his little boyfriends, you know, they came and killed me. But, you know, I spun back. Me, Ted, and Corey jumped them jits. And then guess what? Corey knocked. Guess who? The Travis Scott. I think, actually, no, I don't remember if, if it was Terry or Corey. One of them knocked the Travis Scott again. So guess what? We spun back. And they was dancing on him. And then boom, I pop out, laugh it up on him. He knew it was my team. We all did laugh. Corey was doing L dance. I was doing laugh it up. I forgot what Emo Terry was doing. But yeah. And then he asked me. But then later in the game, we killed his, we killed his other teammate. And then because he, his other teammate survived, he came back. A third time. He spun on me. A third time. So, you know, I had to make this score 3-0. And guess what? I did laugh it up on him again. He, and then that was the end of his team. They started spam adding up. They started spam adding me and stuff like that. And it turns out he messes me on PlayStation that because I have my, my PlayStation account linked to my uh, Fortnite account. So, yeah, we went on to win the game. We was going crazy. We was putting BT on everybody. And then later on, um, guess what? Terry's internet randomly goes out. Now, we, we can come to two conclusions. His internet, his internet in this area coincidentally went out, or one of them just booted him offline. Now, based off the title of the video, I'm assuming y'all can, can answer that for yourselves. But because I didn't know at the time, we were just assuming he probably got booted. Um, I first I messaged him on Xbox and this is this is this is this is what his profile picture is. And then after that I messaged him on PlayStation. Now, you know what I'm saying? At first he was saying 1v1 and I said 9-3-0. And then as you can see on, on the the messages are on the screen. I asked him, did he boot him offline? He said yeah. And I was like, oh. I was like, bruh. And then I was like, what was the, what what was the reason for it? Like it's it's not that deep. It's just a game of Fortnite reload. If you get if I for example, if I get killed and I get L danced on, next game is on site for anybody. Toxic emos are getting pulled out. Or I'll get on my PC, use my secret uh, either use my other account or use my secret little friend to get me an L dance on my main account. But anyways, yeah, he was saying he was saying, um I forgot what he said, but the message on the on the screenshot. I don't have him up on my phone right now. Come recording off of it, but yeah, he was talking about. I think he said something like, "Why are you laughing?" And I was like, "It's not just because your cheeks at the game doesn't mean you have to um, boot someone offline." And then he said, "Not laughing now, huh?" Oh, really, nigga? Oh, 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 shiver my timbers. Guess what? My internet is perfectly fine. Um, my internet was oh, sunshines and rainbows for my internet. 
And this is where you can tell he was a clown. He was a clown. How is he going to say not laughing now, huh? And not even check. I, I didn't. I mean, I had him. I, I added him on Fortnite. I added him on Fortnite. He should have seen if I was just if um I went offline on Fortnite. But he was saying not laughing now, huh? What? If I'm still talking to him, I'm still laughing. And I was like, you know what I'm saying? My internet's fine and dandy and stuff. And um, I was saying, um, and then let's just say, um, I don't think he did it again. But after I mentioned him, I'm still waiting. Guess what? He did it a second time. But he didn't boot me off or Corey off. He booted Terry off a second time. Bro, I, I feel bad. I still feel bad. So if you're watching this, I'm gonna wait till I give you books. I'm gonna give. I, I, I said it. I'm gonna say it again. I'm gonna gift you something. I promise. But he, <laughs> he got booted off a second time. He he must have. He must not. They must. I'm not sure if you know he was just doing unnecessary meat riding to Terry, or he just doesn't see which username he's looking at when he's booting someone offline. He just he just pulled his IP and uh, you know he assumed it was mine. Well, his um his little his little five dollar booting software. I mean, it worked on Terry, but you know Terry's internet went back up after a little bit. He fixed it twice. It didn't really do anything. But then, as we you know, I stopped messaging him because you know I didn't want him to. I didn't want to be like, oh, my internet's still fine, and he you know he actually boot Terry off again. Cause you know <laughs> Terry was. Uh, let's just say he was he was he was not in the best mood after he got booted. But yeah, um, I didn't message him again. And guess what? He did it a third, if I'm not mistaken. He didn't, I don't know, he didn't do it a third time. Terry called us and he was saying that his internet had a privacy warning on it. Which I think that means like they have access to like the admin or something like that. Or they was tracking all the stuff that they was doing on the internet. But eventually, you know what I'm saying? Terry fixed it. And yeah. But yeah, that's the end of the story. I think later on in the night, Corey said he got booted. But me, I still have not gotten booted to this day. If, if, if you're seeing this, Mr. TikTok James, guess what? My internet is fine and dandy. And you, you've, been off, you've been booting off the wrong person. So I, I think your little, your little $5 booting software, it's, it's not working. It's not working. So, you know, you're going you're gonna to have to try again. I mean, I wouldn't say try again because you know I'm not trying to get booted offline, but shoot, you might have to you might have to upgrade to that you know pro plan to whatever five dollar booting software you're on because let's just say it didn't work. Sorry, but yeah, moral of the story. Listen, if you playing a game and someone do some toxic email or they teabag your body or whatever, don't boot them offline. First of all, if I'm not mistaken, that's a crime, and B, it's not worth it. It's not worth it doing all that internet beefing and stuff. That's just a waste of your time. And you could, I mean, if, if someone sees you doing that, you could get in trouble. They could snitch on you, telling people that you booted them offline. <sighs> Mr. TikTok James. And the fact that he had TikTok in his name and he was still cheats. <laughs> that does not help his situation. Let's just say that. But yeah, more of this story. If, if someone does something toxic to you, you take it out on the next lobby. That's what I always do. Every time. I play, I play Fortnite. Someone else dances on me. They get every every kill after that. They're getting laughed up on, and hopefully I win the game so I could. They could expect me doing laugh it up while I get my victory crown. If I'm playing Apex, which I haven't played in a while, I I, I retire from that game. I don't think I'll ever touch it again. Luckily, it's dying. If I play Apex, I'll shoot at everybody's box, teabagging them. If I get teabagged for first, if I'm playing COD, my body gets shot. That person, it depends. If I get into the same lobby as that person, it's get back gang. If it's siege, same thing as Kai. But yeah, I haven't done these videos in a while. And I don't really have that much stories to do it on, so. These 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 type of videos, they just, they just happen. I can't really control them. I think I have another story time, but you know, that's for, that's for, that's for later. But yeah, that's an entire story, story time video. Make sure y'all like, subscribe, and turn on post notifications. And don't forget to comment down below.
Worst case scenario, I run with ideas. What's gonna come in clutch? The comment section. Even if I don't run with ideas, I still know what you wanna see, so still comment down below. With that being said, I'm gonna see y'all next video. Peace.